cool. 969. Nine. Take 5 with Kemi Smalls. Hey y'all, it's S God, and this is my Take 5 with Kemi Smalls. Period. The Nicki Minaj verse on dip. She said, all that rah-rah never was the icon issue. Hype is bizarre. I'm covering the icon issue. I got issues. Yep, I got issues. W, Vogue, Cosmo. I got issues. He did W, Vogue, Cosmo. I got issues. Period. Um, she killed that. She definitely killed that verse. The wordplay, the delivery, the attitude. That's what we love to see. A bad beat to me is somebody who is basically confident in herself and her abilities. Um, someone who makes it a point to encourage herself and also encourage the other women around her. You're not putting your foot in the door when other women are trying to get in. You're not being jealous, you're not being envious, you're not plotting on other people. That's who a bad beat is to me. Someone who's confident in her own self enough to understand and to know that another woman in the room or another woman being as hot as you were, another woman being as pretty or as talented as you are, doesn't make you any less talented, or it doesn't make you any less pretty, or it doesn't make you any less hot, period. That's what a bitch is to me. Big up yourself, big up other women around you, and don't be a jealous ass bitch. That's what a bitch is to me. The one phobia that I have is electrophobia. I am petrified of chickens. I hate, even like thinking about it now, I have goosebumps on my skin. I hate chickens. Um, birds in general, I don't f with birds. Don't f with birds. I made pop shit for everybody who is out there trying to hustle and trying to make it their thing to be a successful person. You know, it comes a point in your life where you know what you are and you know what you have, but you're feeling for other people to understand that too. Maybe so they can appreciate you. Maybe so they can give you what you're, what you're worth. Maybe so they can pay you your worth. Stuff like that. Um, so pop shit is basically just me talking to myself and, you know, talking to the rest of my niggas like, yo, we're hot, we're good, we're here, but I'm still very hungry. I'm still very eager for people to know, like, I want the world to know what I am. I want the world to see me and celebrate me. That's what pop shit is. I cannot wait for the moment where I am a success. I cannot wait for the moment where I prove to myself and prove to other people around me whether they're doubting me or whether they're not doubting me whether they're not supporting whether they are supporting whatever it, it might be just i cannot wait for that moment where you know undeniable that i am what i am and i am a success and you have to celebrate me i think that's what pop shit is no i think i know that's what pop shit is <laughs> and that's how i want everyone to feel when they listen to it like be confident be you know be okay with the fact that it does take time to get to where you want to be but know that you have the ability to get there and all you have to do is just keep doubling your hustle and keep putting in the work round the clock all the time mom if you're watching i'm sorry my guilty pleasure is tequila i absolutely love tequila i love really smooth tequila so my guilty pleasure is tequila i mean we have a couple of favorites don julio I'm on the fence about Azul because I feel like Azul is really sweet, but um, Don Julio for sure, Omeka, Dead Man's Fingers, and this is like tequila sign, um, tequila wine mix I really like. Um, it's called Sandman. So yeah, that's my guilty pleasure. That's my guilty pleasure. The only other guilty pleasure I have is bad and rich niggas. But um, on a serious note, that is my guilty pleasure, tequila. Thank you so much for having me. Again, this is me, S. God, the Supreme, and the only superior, the number one, no other. And this is my take five with Kemi Smalls, period. Tap in.